cafeteria is the place to eat. It's freshly decorated, and you can have all oh, homemade pies and cakes and pastries all made there at the Glendale Cafeteria. Be sure now to eat, dine, and leisure at the Glendale Cafeteria at 222 North Grand Boulevard, right here in downtown Glendale. Taste the difference. Enjoy the quality food its very, very best. It's always served attractively, and they're open from 11 a.m. until 7.30 p.m. every day in the week. At where? At Glendale Cafeteria, of course, in downtown Glendale. Hello there, my name is Ted Colby, and this is the Glendale Grab Bag. What's your name, sir? Robert Crow, sir. Robert Crow? Yes, sir. Where do you live, Robert? 213 South Cedar, Glendale. Right here in Glendale. How long have you lived here? About uh, five years. It's almost an old timer, aren't yeah. you? Well, I'll tell you what. Uh, what do you do for a living? I cook at Bob's. Good. Oh, uh, Bob's drive in. Uh, commercial plug, do I hear it? Number one. <laughs> Number one. Number one. Well, that's good. I want to ask you to stick your hand right into the Glendale grab bag, and let's see what you have on today's program. Originating from in front of Pallox, the big book and stationery shop. Glenn, is that right? What was, what was his first name? Bob. Oh, Bob. Bob working at Bob's. Sure. Sure. Now Bob's opening the, <laughs> opening the envelope, and let's see what's going to be inside. I see a letter there, Bob. Let's have you read the letter. This entitles the order to $5. Personal type lipstick. Oh. Glendale, start in Glendale. That's right, it's a lipstick from uh, Maison Maurice of Glendale. By the way, do you have a best girl or a wife? I'm afraid not. You don't? Well, listen, Bob, I'm going to suggest you right away find a best girl. Uh, How about your mother? expensive. No. No, never wear it. <laughs> Bob, what are you going to do with a $5 lipstick from Maison Maurice? Well, anyway, that's what you got out of the Glendale. Get one of the girls down the place. Of course, they'll really enjoy it. Right. You go by there and pick it up this afternoon. Okay, I'll do that. Thanks Thank a lot, you. Bob. See you again. Uh -huh. Paddock's, you know, it's a big book and stationery shop, and the Glendale grab bag is now coming to you from in front of Paddock's. By the way, I want to tell you about a wonderful Christmas gift. You can't beat a book of Christmas poetry. In fact, if you'll browse around Paddock's at 110 East Broadway, near the corner of Broadway and Brad, You'll find the appropriate Christmas gift for every member of the family. Children right on up to adults. Wonderfully attractive books, all neatly arranged for your own selection. At Paddox, 110 East Broadway, near the corner of Broadway and Brand in downtown Glendale. Make it a browser habit, let's say, and shop at Paddox. Big book and stationery shop in downtown Glendale. Well, this is the Broadway... I was going to say Broadway. It is today the Broadway Glendale grab bag. My name is Ted Colby. What's yours? Gary Hill. Gary, you really talk right into that microphone. I really appreciate that, too. Gary, what was your name and last name was? Helm. Helm. H-E-L-M. And where do you live? 2000 East Choche. Right here in Glendale. Glendale. Well, good old home folk. That's what we like on the air here. <laughs> How old are you? 15. Go to high school? Yes. Where? Uh, Glendale Academy. Oh, fine. Well, do you ever listen to KWIK? We carry most of the football and basketball games, That's you know. That's right. Yeah, you just probably just missed it. I'm going to ask you to put your hand into the glad grab bag today and let's see what you have out of it. By the way, where are you going to spend Christmas? Well, probably, oh, most of it at home working, but... <laughs> You're going to go ice skating or skiing or something? Oh, I, well, I hope you can, too. What do you get out of the grab bag? Uh, two passes to the Temple Theater. Fine. Well, thanks a lot. Congratulations. Maybe next time we'll have you on the Glendale grab bag, too. Hello, Sonny. Come on over and be a guest on our program today. Way down goes the microphone. And what's your name? Ronnie Han. Ronnie what? Ronnie Han. How old are you, Ronnie? Six and a half. You are? You know, your voice is being recorded right now over KWIK. And this afternoon at 4.15, you can, own, you can hear your own voice on the air at 14.90 on the dial. Is that your father with you? Yes. Let's pull him right on down to our side and have him say something to the microphone, too. Hello there, sir. What's yes, your sir. name? Oh, that's my name. Come on down to the microphone, because we're going to talk to Ronnie some more. Yes, sir. Oh, that's my name. I'm the father of this little boy. Fine, Mr. Han. You have a very fine boy. How old are you, Ronnie? Six <laughs> Gee, you're a big man. Come downtown shopping, did you? Tell him you're visiting from Ventura with your daddy. Oh, you over from Ventura? What do you do, Mr. Han? I uh, work at the Railway Express. This is sort of a shopping day yes, for you, isn't it? Good. Ronnie, I'm going to ask you to put your hand into our Glendale grab bag, and there'll be a prize in there for you. Just stick your hand in, that's right, into the big red bag that we call our Glendale grab bag. And uh, in there is an envelope way down the bottom, and now Ronnie pulls it out. Now you open it, and let's see what you got. Now he's opening the envelope. Ronnie's six and a half years old, and he's, oh, he's dressed with little brown slacks, and he's got a sport, little sport coat on, a little white shirt on. 
unbuttoned at the top. He's really quite a boy. What year are you at school, Ronnie, by the way? You go to school? Yes. Well, well what'd you get out of the grab bag, Ronnie? Temple Theater. A pass, Temple for, Theater. A pass for two from the Temple Theater. <laughs> You're learning to read very fast, Ronnie. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Ronnie. We'll see you again over in Glendale. You come back from Ventura again, will you? Mr. Hogg, thanks a lot. See you again. Goodbye. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that just about winds up our program for this afternoon. You've been listening to the Glendale Grab Bag with yours truly, Ted Colby, <laughs> with the grab bag around his neck. Program originating this afternoon from the front of Paddox, 110 East Broadway in downtown Glendale. I'd like to make one more gift suggestion for you. Don't forget Eaton's Stationery. Box Stationery 2 for only a dollar at Paddox, the big book of stationery shop at 110 East Broadway in downtown Glendale. Waterman pens, Schaefer pens, and also Parker 51 pens and pencil sets at Paddox. Remember, the bronzes are always welcome at Paddox in downtown Glendale near, near Grand on East Broadway. Well, now until Monday at the same time, you know we're on the air every day, Monday through Saturday, from 4.15 to 4.30. However, the program is recorded at 3 o'clock each afternoon or thereabouts in front of downtown Glendale Merchants. So until Monday then, good afternoon.